March is Women's History Month, a time to recognize women's accomplishments, but every day at Hope's Women's Center, they not only recognize the women's accomplishments, but they make them happen, and they're making it easier now with, for women to thrive by extending their hours and, of course, helping them with their mental health. And Tammy is here with us again. How are you, Tammy? I'm good, thank you. So this Love is, being here. It's beginning of the year. Um, we know yes. this is a time wow. that um, is very crucial for the Hope's mm -hmm. Women's Center yeah. because you're starting to see women start to kind of like make that New Year's resolution going, right. I gotta be better myself, I gotta leave this right. situation, mm -hmm. and they're starting to come in, and that's Absolutely. where you said the extended hours are very important right yes. now. Yes, we really wanted to be able to offer more opportunities for more women to come, women that were working to be able to come. So we're open later, we're opening more days a week, we're opening on Saturdays, some now. So just making it as, it as easy as possible for women to find us and to come and get help and get all the resources that yeah. we have. You said something very important, mm -hmm. and that's women who are working. Because I think sometimes mm -hmm. when we think of the Hope's Women's Center, it's those who are not working, those who are going through tragedy, right. which is the case. But it's also it a place for women who are working, who are trying to better their lives, because you have programs like that. Absolutely. Or we've helped them get a job, and then we don't want them to not be able to still <laughs> come and get the resources for us. So yeah. really being able to provide that wraparound care for them. For them. Uh, Big thing right now is mental health. Yes. And you have noticed it even in the past before yes. we really brought it to the forefront. Yeah. But right now you guys are really concentrating on that for women we because we are starting to see... A, a, a very big leap in not just in the women but in the children too mm -hmm. and that's where you're starting to work more with everyone. We are. We're trying to work with teens. We've expanded our Hope for Teens program. We actually have an app that they can access that provides some mental health, just coaching and encouragement, education, information and then with our Hope for Teens programming in person we also are doing a lot of classes around what does it look like to be a healthy, to be emotionally healthy, to have safe relationships, substance abuse prevention when we know how to deal with stress and how to handle our anxiety. So a lot of around that mental health topic. Yeah. Um, I, I like that the Hope's Women's Center is mm -hmm. working with the teens and not, I'm going to say preaching to the teens. Right, but, an app, mm -hmm. you know? Some yeah. people don't think, okay, right. why are you going to do an app? Because that's where the kids oh, so are. Speak their language. Right, <laughs> speak their language. And that's what you're doing with them. Yeah. And that a lot of times is just a way for them to find out our services. It's not just a place their mom goes. It's something that is really accessible for them. We have a great team that's working on just making those things engaging for them. So it's something that they look forward to. And then we have all the gift cards and resources for them as well, like we do for their moms. Right, and you, that's where you just said, right, mm -hmm. the gift cards and resources, what you need help with. Yes. And, and that's what you're asking for. We know everyone is going through, mm -hmm. you know, times right now with inflation, with food and everything. But right especially the women that come yep. to the center Absolutely. are really going through it and it do. comes down to wow do i pay for that bus pass yeah. to get to work to pay for my kids or do i use that little bit of money to put food, food on, on the, the table, table. And yep. it's a cycle there. And so that's why you're looking for donations, looking for people, right. especially the gift cards. Very easy to do, right? It is very simple for people to do gift cards. We have hope drives that are listed on our website. They can bring in toiletries, food, clothing, just everything that a woman would need for her family that she then earns the points through our programs. And she feels very empowered to be able to provide that. And she doesn't have to choose between dinner or if I'm going to be able to get to work. Yeah, And I'm going to put you on the spot on this, Tammy, because okay. you just said something that's very important mm -hmm. is that you guys do not give a handout, you give a hand up right. by helping them actually work because yes. some places will go, here you go, and they keep coming back. Mm -hmm. With you, you're helping them work so they get into a rhythm yes. of knowing that if I work, I receive. Yes these things and that's what's important. And even in the most simplest ways they learn to budget. They earn points for their classes but then they budget their points. Do I need it for utility assistance because we help with that or do I need it for this dress that looks amazing that I want or do I need it for toilet paper or yeah. food for my family, cleaning supplies, so many things that yeah. they're able to do yeah, with their is. points. Well Tammy I'll tell you it's a great time right now for us to give especially yeah. this whole month with it International is. Women's History Month. Yep. National Women's Day is on uh, March, March 8th. 8th. How can people help out and find out more about the Hope's Women's Center? So we do qualify for the Arizona Charitable Tax Credit, so that's coming up as people are thinking about their taxes and filing their taxes. Our website, hopewomencenter.org, gives lots of ways that they can be involved and give to help what we're doing. Well, like so. Tammy, thanks mm -hmm. for stopping in again. Thank Appreciate you. it. Thank you. Thank you.